Well, that's a big hit. It's late in the game. That puts you up four runs. What happens late in the game now with the four-run lead? A grand slam can't beat you if you happen to give one up. That's a big run. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. Just got a piece of it as it's fouled back. On its way, the 0 1 pitch. Changeup gets him out in front for strike two. Two down, runners at first and second. Now a swing and a ground ball, but a foul ball, and the count holds it 0 2. Well, he tried to get a little cute right there, a little two strike changeup. He thought he might get a swing and miss, but man, he left that in the zone. He's fortunate that ball didn't leave the park. Hit on the ground to third. On to second for the force out, and the side is retired. Jake Smolinski will stay in the I'm ball game as a light. Only do the catching from here out. Josh Fegley is into the ball game here as he takes over behind the plate. Now catching. Paulo Orlando is in to start things off here as he looks at a called strike. It's nothing in one. Objective number one right here is finding a way to get on base. So I'm not surprised to see him taking on the first pitch there. Well hit, but also well fouled into the seats and left. And that slider's almost in the dirt. Now that's a slider that's pretty easy to recognize. Started on the outside, you know it's gonna continue to run off the plate. But one that's difficult is that one that starts in at you and still breaks over the plate. This one's down to third. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. The batter, number two. Short Here's stop. Alcides Escobar, Alcides. the shortstop. Escobar. Into the windup and the pitch. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Throw on to first is going to take care of him as the Royals are now down to their last chance now. Now batting second baseman. Now at the plate, Whit, Whit Merrifield. A couple of walks for him thus far. A oh. fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. Ryan Bell gets the call here as he'll try and look for one out to finish this thing off. That's wide 2 0. The 2 0 on the way. And that changeup makes him jump, a swing and a miss. Set to deliver on 2 and 1. Swing and a miss. And now the Royals are down to their final strike. Has them down to their final strike. Here it comes. Ball three. Three and two now. And this ball swung on and hit to center field. And this should do it. And that's going to be your final out here. And the A's have taken the opener here at home as this ball game is over. Yeah, the home crowd is loving it as they jumped out in front in the bottom of the eighth. And they did what they had to do in the ninth to seal the deal and tonight's ends at a six to two finish Liam Hendricks earns his team leading 11th win so that'll put a wrap on things here this evening for my partners Harold Reynolds and Dan Plezak I'm Matt Vaskersian this has been a presentation of MLB the show for more follow us on Twitter at MLB the show. Here now is our final line score tonight. First for the victorious Athletics. Six runs, 11 hits, no errors. They left four men on base. For Kansas City, two runs on eight hits, no errors. They left nine runners on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and two minutes. A reminder that extra BART train service is available on the Fremont Daily City Line or on the Fremont Richmond Line by accessing the ramp directly outside the stadium beyond the left field wall. AC Transit will also be available.